could be his secret weapon. All right, seven One million people are watching. Which they want to win. This is a golden opportunity for Lewis. Missed the travel. Ways now is struggling to hold his throne. Eighty one to. I like the way they're like a guardsman who doesn't go past the hut with his rifle. He wants twelve bull. Redick! And a good play! Extreme pressure. James Way picked up that ball. And he would have been a relieved man to see that going in because Lewis was resting on double top to win the set against the throw. And now Wade has retrieved the situation which seemed to be sliding away from him. Well, even Dickens as Mr. McCorber would have been daft enough to have a bet on this. Could well go to the very last leg of 11 sets. Very well. 40. I love the way that Lewis can be so nonchalant about the third dart but still guides it home like a missile. Well, you know what he did with the third dart in the 06 World Championship against Manley. 100. He threw it without looking. Manley, not pleased. Lovely darts. Still alive, first dart. 95. Just crossed the level, yes, crossed the line. Unfortunate deflection there, Wade. Has been made to work hard in this set to hold the throw. He hasn't done it yet, but looking good. Looking set. 140. Will be at the double first. Aidy's got to pulverise the red bit. This one probably is. Ah! Oh, I was going to say definitely. Silly me. And that was his strength against Taylor. Just when the leg seemed to be slipping away, he produced a maximum to really. Hit and put pressure on his rival. Brilliant dust! By way! Two dots. 100. Jamie Clark's 50. Fat 10. He tops. To retain. Never thrown on his own through. Red bit! Too high. Fight it off! Put it on two! Well, what a vital dart, Sid. And that's the second leg in succession that Wade has called out. It's a bull in the last leg, double top there. He still leads, but that was a sweeper. Well, we seem to have a bit of a dispute up there about stamping on the hockey, I believe it is. And it looks like a fairly serious argument. Uh, George Noble, the referee, is stepping in. Uh, situation weird, leading 3 2. Crowd restless, they've been on weird's back. We'll find out more about what's happening with his John Gwynn. To take the place of Dave Lanning. Yes, thanks very much. And uh, every set has gone with throw. Yes, Sid, I think a bit of news has come your That's way right. already. Yeah. Eddie was accusing Wade of stamping on the hockey. Reverse. You need to shake the hockey when you're so you can't get a good platform. 43. Good quality match, but. We've often seen a bit of spice. <laughs> One of a better word. <laughs> yeah. Live things up. Evans, wow. jockey, Brissy. <laughs> spice girls. Easy. Why not spice girls? But uh, the fact is, Sid, that uh, Dave was saying earlier, wasn't he, that this game has really yet to quite take off. 40. It might yet as we move towards the close. And amazing. Six stars if he likes. But his favourite, Dabalton, for the title. And two young men have given us a fine match, but the deserving champion is Wayne. What a talent, what a talent. And you never won a major. That's James Fifth, UK champion twice. Match play champ, UK Open champ, Premier League champ. The man from Alderaan, all the shots is our sharp shooter, John. Able
certainly is. And it's about time, I would think, in his mind, he says, that I did that, that I won another title. And he's done it here in Dublin tonight. From, from this week, do you think Adrian Lewis? Well, that he's got world title in him. You know, not just saying it, he actually can believe it now. You know, by beating Phil Taylor, that's the one thing that he's going to take from here. I've beaten Phil Taylor on the big stage in front of big crowds, and now I can, you know, push on from here. And what about pushing on for, for James Wade now? Everyone will say, look, there's still one thing that's eluded you, the, the world title. Has he got the game to, to, to continue that sort of form for the for two weeks of a world championship? Yeah, no question. I mean, he, he is a class act, Dave. He really is. He's a solid player. He doesn't throw many darts away. You know, he hasn't got the, the fast action like a lot of the guys have got. He's got a Phil Taylor action in as much as that he throws every single dart. Very deliberate, like Dennis Priestley used to. £100,000 is, is what you've won. Um, I know you like your cars. Are you going to treat yourself to a new car or, or what, oh. what are you going to do with it? I don't know, I, I'm not even thinking about the money, it's not about the money, it's about the tournament, you know, it's about, it's about the title. Um, a few years ago when I was a little bit younger, a little bit more naive, um, I thought it was about the money, but it's not. It's about winning titles, um, that's why I do it. It's taken me a long time to dis discover that though. Stay with us just for a, uh, a second, uh, Rod Studd is talking to uh, a gallant loser. Adrian, thanks for talking to us so soon after the match. Yesterday you shook the whole world of sport by beating Phil Taylor, but 24 hours on, the emotions are very different. Just sum up the contrast for us, if you could. Um, well, pretty in one word, or... Um, we, obviously, I mean, he's been there many times before now. I think he's, that's his fifth um, title. Um, that's my me, me first, probably, major on, live on Sky. Um, we well, did the job, you know. Um, I missed a few stupid shots um, where I should have really took the set. Um, and then let way the end, and he finished well. Uh, but um, I say what, me and Wade will play each other a fair few times now. You watch this, um, and I think it'll. Um, he's won the first one. That's all I'll say to you. He won't many more than that. Yeah, there seems to be quite a, a rivalry developing here. Halfway through the match, there seemed to be a few words exchanged and a bit of finger wagging and finger pointing. What was going on there, Eddie? Um, tell you the truth. Um, there was a lot of movement on the stage when I, when I was throwing. Um, Where well, he said it wasn't, um, I saw his foot, um, but that's all I'll say about it. Thanks for talking to us, Andy. Well done, reaching the final. We'll see you at the World Championship. You certainly will. Thank you. Cheers. Look, uh, James, you, you thought some more you had to say, Dave? You... Um, Got smacked, really. Um, I'm not going to go really into it, you know, because mm. this is a professional game and, and we're, we're, we're professional sportsmen. Um, anyone can watch any replay if they want. Mm. They can watch my feet. They did not move. Darts needs rivalry, though, mm. doesn't it? Of course and, it does. And you two, from now on, th there's going to be there's going to be big rivalry between you, isn't there? I believe Adrian Lewis is probably one of the best players in the world. Well, there's no probably about it. He's, mm. he's one of the best players in the world. Um, if I can be one of the best players in the world, questionable because it depends what James Wade turns up. You know, Adrian Lewis goes up there and he hits 180s, he hits 160s, he hits he hits ridiculous scores that on a you know it's it's like a it's like a switch. You know, he bangs it on straight away. Um, am I as good at scoring as him? No. Am I as good at finishing? Yes. And I think that's what won me tonight. You know, I hit the right shots at the right time. Congratulations. Thank you so much. You're the champion. Fantastic night for you. Uh, a fifth major title for James Wade.